Each week of the high school football season and basketball season, 1150 WIMA and WOSN will feature a Fellowship of Christian Athletes Athlete of the Week. Tonight, Salina Jr. Stetson Miller getting that honor for his work restarting the FCA chapter in Salina, which I had the chance to kick off this new school year this morning with some of those Bulldogs that have had some of their own trials to get to this point. I went to the volleyball all-nighter by myself, which some of the people told me they were going to go, but they didn't. So I went by myself, and I felt very alone, and I didn't want other people to feel that way. So after I went there, I realized, man, something needs to change. We really wanted to get FCA started because I really felt led. Uh, once Steve Stroh actually brought me to an FCA meeting at the actual studio a couple years ago, um, I really like to see different, uh, n not necessarily athletes, but different people throughout schools who just are kind of maybe afraid to announce that they're Christians of the world, but when they can come together into a group like this, it's really powerful. We had a lot of kids here today that I was really surprised that they even showed up, and so I'm, I'm really excited about it. I'm just glad that everyone can come and hope that it goes as well as it did today. I thought it went very well. A great group of students tuned in this morning starting at 6.45 a.m., and they have some great plans for the upcoming school year. I've got the volleyball shirt on from last year. I'm hoping to really get that going and that advertised. But I'd also like to maybe get a different uh, couple winter events done, like dodgeball tournaments or just get-togethers and different stuff like that. I want to be able to tell people that, hey, Salina is FCA, come join us. I want people to realize that you like don't have to be afraid to show what you believe in. and. You don't have to go with your peers and do whatever they have to do. Like you can not make bad decisions in high school and it's worth it. So I want people to not feel alone.